Welcome to the All Things Microsoft Cloud video series, where we're going to be talking about how you as a developer can use different building blocks across the overall Microsoft Cloud to build different applications. My name is Dan Wallin. I'm here with my colleague, Aicha Bash. Hi, Dan. I'm so excited to be here. My name is Aicha Bash. I work at Microsoft as a Cloud Advocate in the same team with Dan. And today we're going to talk about Microsoft Cloud. But oftentimes when we say Microsoft Cloud, People think that uh, Azure is the Microsoft Cloud, but today in this series, we will cover what else is included in the Microsoft Cloud, right? Then we have Microsoft 365, GitHub, Power Platform, and we can build amazing solutions by using all these uh, products, including um, Microsoft 365, Power Platform, and GitHub. So we have a great resource to discover what is available for us to build a solution by using Microsoft Cloud in general. Would you like to just walk us through the documentation available for our Microsoft Cloud? Yeah, so I know starting out as a, either an IT leader maybe, or architect or even developer where there's just so many, many building blocks out there. Um, it's kind of hard to wrap your head around sometimes on what would I combine to build the application that I need to build so uh, in the Azure Architecture Center, and we'll put a link up here for folks, uh, we have a documentation that'll walk people through, number one, you know, how can you create applications uh, more quickly, which is good, but also better applications more quickly and that are very secure. Um, you know, I know actually you've done a lot with Power Platform, for example, Power Virtual Agents and all the stuff that goes with that. So you might be able to take advantage, for instance, of some folks that are more in the low code crowd. But then you also have the full-time developers who are building apps. And how can you combine those worlds to build these apps more quickly, efficiently, and better, um, but also get them out there in a way that's very secure and also take advantage of some of the different building blocks. So you mentioned like Microsoft 365. And one of the guests we have uh, in this video series is Yina from Microsoft Graph. And she'll walk us through kind of how we can get started with that. But that would be an example of, that's kind of a bunch of building blocks, right? Microsoft yes. Graph <laughs> that we can use and pull that into our custom app. So anyway, this documentation will walk people through how to get started with that um, and what the best approaches would be. And then they can dig deeper in the docs from there. When we talk about all these technologies, it sounds a little crowded, too, too many services and products available, but these are all compatible to work together, right? So it is easy to build something when you use Azure and Microsoft 365, and they blend uh, very well in the solution. And it's easier to come up with a solution, uh, but whatever you need in your own company, it's easier to build by just using all these technologies together. Yeah, and that's really the key part of this documentation is like you started this off with saying, we tend to think Azure and Azure is super critical, but we can combine these other technologies with Azure. And as you're mentioning, these services work well together, whether it's like security context flowing uh, through the different parts or other aspects. And again, I like to think of it like taking different building blocks and you kind of build on top of each other. Yeah, exactly. And productivity collaboration became really popular uh, these days. And the data behind it is quite popular. Building apps for increasing productivity and collaboration became very popular. So just uh, working on the solutions like collaborative apps, um, it's really easy to build something using Azure, per platform and Microsoft 365 as well as GitHub. So in this series, all things Microsoft Cloud, we will focus on each and every technology, as I mentioned earlier, Microsoft 365, Azure, um, Power Platform, and GitHub. And we will have special guests to deep dive into each and every technology we just mentioned. So if you're interested, stay tuned and keep on watching our series. Thank you so much, everyone. Bye.